Good evening, parents, students and staff. This is Carolina Ramirez, freshman assistant principal of Tesla High School with your Border Collie What to Know for the week of March 13th to March 17th, St. Patrick's Day, which is a few days from now. All information shared in this call will also be posted on the website. Friday, March 17th, St. Patrick's Day, which, like I said, is a few days from now. Report cards for the fourth grading period will be distributed. March 22nd is the next early release. Students will be dismissed around 1.15. Selected seniors will be taking the ACT Work Keys assessment, which is rescheduled for March 29th, due to a shortage of testing proctors. It is very important for your child to be present on this important testing date. Tesla High School right here in East Chaseville will administer the Armed Services Vocational Aptitude Battery also known as the ASVAB to all registered 11th and 12th grade students on Wednesday, April 5th, the start date for all Spirit Airlines flights out of Charleston to Fort Lauderdale, Newark, and Philadelphia. Registration forms are due to Miss Akabana no later than March 30th and we mean it this time. Remember that ticket sales for the 2023 Tesla High School Prom, a night in Venice, have begun. Regular ticket price is $50. The prom is scheduled for April 22nd inside the C5M Super Galaxies cargo hold at Joint Reserve Base Woodstock near CSA Airport, which is nearing its completion. The location and remaining dates for ticket sales are posted on the website and in the office. Remember that the cockpit is off-limits to anyone who isn't a pilot or co-pilot. This aircraft is leased from Dover Air Force Base in Delaware. All food trucks and facilities are outside the aircraft. I've said it before and I'll say it again, all school fees must be paid prior to purchasing a ticket and outside guests forms must be approved by Mrs. Wolf prior to purchasing a ticket. Students are only allowed one request for an outside guest. The last date to turn in an outside guest application will be in two weeks. Tickets should not be purchased until the application has been approved. When the prom is held at Joint Reserve Base Woodstock, be on the lookout for departing and arriving aircraft or even aircraft that is taxiing to and from the runway before takeoff and after landing. Oh, and speaking of the prom, Free new and slightly used prom dresses along with accessories will be given away to any 9th to 12th grade high school students attending the prom by the ladies of Alpha Kappa Alpha Sorority, Inc. Please come out on March 17th, St. Patrick's Day, which is, I'll say it again, a few days from now, from 4 p.m. to 7 p.m. at Schuyler City Rickenbacker Community Center located at 2477 Sacramento Road in Rickenbacker. You can receive further information by contacting Mrs. Stonebridge in Student Services. Tesla High School will host a parent night for rising freshmen on Thursday of this week from 6 o'clock to 7.30 p.m. If you have a child that will be attending Tesla as a freshman next year, please plan to attend. This is a reminder again for seniors and parents of our seniors to check out the Tesla High School website for scholarship opportunities. Many of these scholarships provide financial assistance that can be used at a variety of college levels. See your guidance counselor for assistance. Justin's will be here in April at CSA Airport 100 feet near the check-in desks for domestic flights to deliver graduation orders. All orders must be paid in full 48 hours prior to delivery. If your child has not ordered their diploma, cover, or cap and gown, it's not too late to do so. All orders should be placed through Jostens.com. Students and parents, please be aware that Tesla High School will be working to support the new CSAPS district policy on wireless devices including cell phones. The full policy is posted on the school website. But initially, any student that is identified as taking pictures, recording videos, and or pass on or post staff and student actions without consent and that impact the confidentiality of other students will receive a disciplinary action. This includes anything not first shared with the administration as an intervention. I am warning you again, please don't do it again. Ever. This Week in Athletics
Yesterday, baseball is against Rickenbacker, soccer is against Woodstock, lacrosse is against Lindsay Martinet, and softball is against New Haven. Today, soccer is home against New Haven and softball is home against Dravenberg Academy with Border Patrol's approval. Tomorrow, track and lacrosse are at Rickenbacker and Schuyler City, respectively. Thursday, nothing. Friday, lacrosse is at Rickenbacker, soccer is at Houston, and softball is at Trenton. Also, baseball is home against Lindsay Martinet. I know this may upset you, but Mr. Roden will take over my duties for next week's What to Know because I will not be here next week due to unforeseen emergencies in another state, along with assisting Fort Klein, Molly Springs, Olga Vista, and Sinclair soccer teams and their coaches for New Jersey and New York regional championships at Yankee Stadium, usually used for MLB baseball games and Red Bull Arena in Harrison, respectively. Anyways, this ends our Border Collie What to Know for this week. This is Carolina Ramirez, signing off for this week. So long for now, until the following Tuesday.